It's the grind fest that you didn't want in your life. I'm already asleep. I'm fast asleep with one sliver of health left on an Ivysaur. Welcome back to it, everybody. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. Grind is real. I feel like Vileplume just isn't- it has a different experience bar than most, because I felt like I was... Yeah, chipping it's, away, it's, like it's just taking up. forever, yeah. Yeah, third tier evolution usually is a little longer. It's rough, yeah. Which is weird, because Grass Pokemon are supposed to level up pretty easily. They do, but Vileplume is, uh, pretty hard to get. Yeah, that's true. Alright. Charging this boy Man, up. I, I should run in the grass. Move's to gotta be there. Like just it's gotta be super close. You've been you've gone through a couple Actually, battles. Actually, I don't already. know because I mean Vileplume level they leveled up at the same time Fuck. last time, so I imagine that Maybe a couple battles. It's not too far away. Get your trainer now. Wall Cameron. Meowth's I mean, not now. A me wild know. meowth. Oh. Let me know if you want more quetchies. Quetch it up. Okay, we're sick. crutching. We're crutching around. We're crutching down, dude. I'm I'm crutching Whee. it until I stop crutching. My brain was not prepared for that. It's all right. I'm just off a 15 hour car ride. I'm like, what? Yeah, I feel you. Let's crutch. Uh, this is from Strange Journey Redu or okay. Redux, excuse Redux. me. Okay. If you could make any one change to the type chart, what would it be? So like, X is now super effective against Y. Z no longer resists Q, etc. I think it's pretty fucking good right now. Yeah, it's pretty tight. I don't. I hate that ice is so poopy. I wanted. I wanted poison to be stronger for a long time, and then they made it stronger. So I'm happy now. Agreed. How about you, Gerard? I don't really have much. I think uh, my only thing is I wish they were a little more clearer what the Pokemon were. I get you. Like the hybrid type stuff is fine, but like sometimes you look at a Pokemon and you're like, look at Marowak, and you're like, what the fuck are you? It could be well, anything. When you, when you go into the new gen. It tells you, if you've ever seen it before, it tells you what type it is, and it tells you what moves are effective and super effective. Which is nice. Oh wow, they really go that far, huh? Yeah. If you've fought it before. Yeah, if it's new, you're like, uh... If it's new, you have to I figure mean, it out. I mean, that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's new, you have to figure it out, but like, that's not that big of a deal. Right. It's kind of cool, because like, your decks like, now knows. I think, it's, I think that's super neat. Exactly. It's like, ooh. Man, the, the confusion... Yeah, it's rough. There we go, finally. It just, it, I don't know why, but that Confuse just hits Vileplume so rough. I love Vileplume. Because it's poison type. Ooh, this is a Confusion cool one. Confusion affects it in a certain, Confusion so? is super effective against Vileplume, because it's, Vileplume is poison type. I see. Oh, so Psychic, you mean. Any Psychic, any Psychic type attack is gonna hurt a poison type Pokemon. Right, so just by doing Petal Dance and being confused, it's already in a different you're, state of mind. You're using a non-effective move against the Poison type. When you, when you, when you Petal Dance a Poison type. Oh, so Petal Dance, so it's hurting me by using Petal Dance on Weezing. It's just not the most efficient way of... I guess, I, I mean, with Vile Plume, there's not a good way to fight a Poison type. Yeah, you're doing, you're doing what you should be doing. Yeah. Pedal Dance just does a good amount of damage to get me through the- Yeah, it just yeah. tanks through. I'm just saying, like, there, you don't really have an option. Yeah. Right. Uh, oh. here we go, here's the miss. How annoying. Alright, let's go back to yep, town. there's let's the heal miss. Up. That sucks. Let's heal up a little bit. Alright, this next one's from Arc Vape. Arc Vape? Yeah, I'll go Arc Vape. Sick. This is a cool one. Sorry I changed your name, bro, but hey, let's... Let's keep going. Let's go with it. Arc yeah. Vape. What's the most rewarding and or satisfying secret boss that you've ever defeated and why? Fuck, man. The weapons. Final Fantasy VII? Yeah. I did not ever think I was gonna be able to do that. Or actually, no, in Final Fantasy... It was like one of the GBA games added some, like, hard-ass bosses. I think it was five or four. Just, like, added some bosses that were just like, whoa. I can't believe I beat these guys. I'm trying to think. I think Final Fantasy just nails it every time. Whenever they do like secret bosses like that, they're always Final Fantasy has always good ones. Yeah, yeah, they always got the best ones. I wish there was more stuff like that in this game. I wish there was like a lot more places to fight trainers like after you beat the game. Like some post game secret stuff. Yeah. That'd be really cool. I think uh, Mount Silver is kinda cool in Johto. That's a nice one. It's true. It's really really high level. The Cerulean Cave is pretty decent. But I mean, you can't get that until you beat. But it wants to fight. Um, Robert Balls wants to know... Robert Balls? Robert... 
Bob balls. Bob balls. How Bob. many experience are you getting per fight, Alex? Uh, so like, check this out. So, v uh, Bulbasaur, I don't get that much. But again, remember, I don't have EXP share on. Right. So, so it's it's it would be double what I would usually get. Yeah. So I'm pulling 493 from that Bulbasaur. So this, okay. Then the Ivysaur is about a K each. Each give me about a thousand. Yeah. Wow. Wow. And then I go fight the other guys. <clears throat> and if I run into the in if I run into something in the grass that I don't like, it's not that big of a deal. <clears throat> but like I'm getting 1087 there and another 1087 right here. S Yo, Bust and Moose should evolve any second now. Yeah, it's pretty fucking quick. Um, so Bob Balls wants to know, Gerard, Alex, and Chris, when you're having a terrible day and you're depressed, what food do you reach for to make it better? Everything. When Real I'm talk. having a terrible day and I'm feeling depressed, what food do I get? Probably pizza is like the number one. Pizza is good. Or like a double-double. Yeah. Double-double like always a makes burger. me feel good. Yeah. I think I'm with Gerard. I just like food when I'm sad. I am a stress eater. Me too. And I fucking hate that. Because if I wasn't stressed out, I'd be a twig. But I'm stressed out all the time, so I just keep consuming food. Chips are like a good go-to for me if I'm sad. It's like, give me a fucking bag of chips. I'm, I'm just in. snobby. Like, I'll definitely eat shit, but I'm very, like, <clears throat> particular about exactly what shit I want at any given time. Clefairy and Clefairy! <laughs> Aren't they cute? They're good. They're fine. Get drained. Get your mind blown. All right, this is from Lou. Oh, no. fuck smog. No. I ain't gonna do shit. You're good. Maybe you miss, isn't it? No, that's smoke screen, baby. No, they're all the same to me. Yeah, you're doing good. Yeah, all them gas moves. All of them are involved with changing your oil in your car, what does, so. What does Lou <laughs> want to know? Lou wants to know. You think professional swimmers should be allowed to gain fish-like mutations in the future? No. What well, if everyone could do it? If it was regulated and like very, very like standardized, I don't, I don't know. I don't think so. swimming wouldn't be a thing anymore. Yeah. I feel like the point of swimming is like to test your ability to train yourself. If you can just mod yourself, I don't know like how legit that becomes. That's my instinct, but. I could be convinced. Ugh, come on, Vile Plume, get back in it. Jesus Christ. What? what? No, I'm not even gonna. No. Is it a hurt, hurtful question to us? It's not hurtful, it's fucked up. Is it about death? Mm, kind of. I'm, I'll read it, but I'll blur it out if we don't want this. Okay. It's fucking weird. Uh, okay. All right. Shit like that makes me uncomfortable. Because okay. I hate weird. It's weird. Okay. okay. This is from. I'm not gonna give them a name. <laughs> Call him Joey from uh, Friends. This is from Joey. Joey from Friends. Joey wants to know, it's one of these creepy ones. I noticed you still haven't answered my previous question, so I'll offer you another. Already a great start. Yeah. <laughs> Have you sacrificed any mammals within the past week? If not, then why do you sin? That was just a bit. Yeah. It's fucked up. Just a bit. This is fucked up. Is it? I, kind of. I don't know anyone who I sacrifices eat, mammals. I eat food. Uh, I'm happy to hunt an animal. Like, if that's what this is about, mm -hmm. like I would happily kill my f my my food if I had to to get meat. It's the best I can say. No religious sacrifices though. No, it's not. Uh, not, not about that week. life. No, not this week. I haven't done that this week. This week wasn't that the question? Have you sacrificed any animals this week? Yeah, but like this week. I'm just answering specific <laughs> to the question. I didn't do that this week. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I've not done that either. That's a big no for me this yeah, week. I've never uh, done that. Wasn't part of my week. Um, that's a cool question, but I'm gonna skip that one. Hey, 56! Yo, it's real! Oh, shit! It's happening! Sorry, I got really hyped there. Uh, I gotta get rid of a move. Fuck Dragon Rage. Dragon Rage does not Really? Need to get rid of it now? Yeah. You don't need it anymore. Outrage you have is outrage now. amazing. Alright. Outrage is a dragon type pedal dance, and there's, oh, there's no fairy type in this gen, so you're so, good. You do anything, you win. Just look Great. out for Ice Beam. <coughs> That's really your only thing you Chris, should be afraid of. Chris, play the song. Oh, you want to play the song when it's evolving? Just right now. I'm in. Text me the song name so I don't forget. Oh my god. Yeah. This is hype. Y'all thought it wasn't gonna happen. But it's happening. There he is! Oh, it's so a beautiful cute. boy!
Right at the end, this motherfucker's gonna feet, fight the Elite Four. He sure is. You put so much work into that Pokemon. I did. Which is good though. Take that EXP share off that mother farter. You gonna use him once just to do it? It's like uh, celebrate? No, because he's not right yet. I need, I need to name him. Oh yeah, it's right. But I need to also level up. So when we're so done, fight the we trainers, then we'll him. go level up. Yeah, yeah, I get you. I'm just saying, it's gonna take the same amount of time either way. To do what? Level him and name him. What are you talking about? I mean, you're gonna have to name him, and then you're gonna have to level him. He's already high level. That's true. He's he's level 57, 56. Are you just going to like mid 50s for everybody? That's what Chris recommended. I think that's about yeah. Either either you want to do 60 for everyone or mid 50s. I think you're gonna be fine. All right, I'm gonna just aim for 50, 50, 55 then for everybody. That's, that's what I've been. That's what my goal is. Yeah, I think you'll be good with that. Because your type matchups will be fine. You have weaknesses for the hit there, Pokemon. All right. Crutch me up. Um, this is from Sayo Kitty, and I, I'm, it says just for me, but I think it, you guys can answer this too, because it's not just a me thing. Okay. It says, Chris, what do you think about gay representation in gaming? Uh, it's about equal with where it is everywhere else, which is not enough for the amount of like importance it has. Well, and for me, it's like there's a lot of it's a it's like a market that has a lot of people that have disposable income, and so for a group of people that have a lot of money to spend, it's like maybe a little more could be needed. I think like there's a certain companies that take the right steps and do things like, hey, you can be gay in this game for a romance option or da 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 da. Yeah, um, just so treat it like the same as all other parts of reality. Yeah, because that's the real thing. Is like for me, right? Like the thing that makes me feel anxious is the type of criticism of like. Why you gotta, you know, these liberals bringing gays into our games? It's like, it's not like that. It's like you're trying to pretend like gay people don't exist. Right. And all this game is doing is telling you that they're there. You don't have to, like, be chill with it. Turn into a gay person to look at a gay person. Right. You're not gonna catch the gay. Yeah, yeah. You... It's not like a poke virus or anything. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Like, and there's something, I, I don't know. It's just such an easy thing to not care about. I agree. I think like there, I think representation is really important. I think like I'm really glad there's a lot of like not specifically about like queer things, but like um, women are getting a lot better representation in video games, which I like. Your games like Hellblade coming out, Tomb Raider, where like it's a pretty strong female Rise character. Zero Dawn. People are just starting to realize like, oh, like this actually isn't like going to be bad for business. Like, right. Fucking Black Panther is like the best movie ever now. Yeah. Or something. And it's, it's like, like one of the biggest movies ever made, and it's just like. An unknown character, practically in the like public consciousness. Mm -hmm. The name is like associated with something like much more controversial in most cases, like, and it slaughtered the box office. It destroyed. It was yeah. amazing, and it's good. Delete, delete a move to make room for synthesis. Ooh, should I use synthesis instead of leech seed? It would save you a turn, I guess. Kind of, but Leech Seed does like Loose, stabbing damage. Yeah, Leech Seed like helps me. I, I think I'm not gonna take it. It only has five PP too. Yeah, it's not worth it. That's good. That's good. That's it's good. tight that he learns it. So he doesn't learn like Sludge Bomb or something good. I wish that he learned Sludge Bomb. That would like change the game for me. Yeah, now we're really start. I'm really starting to effectively level up my guys because yeah, I'm not spinning it anymore. You're not so. sapping your experience. Yeah. That's good. That's I good. feel like I just feel like I'm still not in the best possible place I could be. I think you should try if you should. Alex. I mean, in this episode alone, I think I've gained two levels of file plumes, so I'm feeling pretty good. File plumes level what? It's 48. Yes. Okay. Oh, I'm still in the battle. Shit. Uh, all right. Let me get out of this. Ooh, this is cool. This is from Chief Takenawa. Um, what is the most important part of your daily routine? Also, I love you guys. Fuck. When Gerard liked to my picture on Instagram, I flipped out. Stay clean, <laughs> boys. That's cute. I get I get a lot of people who freak out about it because I, 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 when I'm on Instagram, I search hashtags and stuff and kind of get... You run into stuff? Yeah. Well, it's two things, right? One is like, I actually get like down that rabbit hole. It's ironic because I don't really post a lot on Snapchat or uh, rather Instagram. But uh, two, I also have like a Instagram aggregator that like showcases related tags to me so I can like like them and comment on them and stuff. So it helps me find like things that are curated to me, um, and uh, yeah, I tend to go down some rabbit holes. Lil, we've all—that's a real thing. I never—I like used Instagram a lot, and then I just stopped. Hey, Alakazam, wake the fuck up and kill this Ivysaur, bro. 
So then the question is like, what's something that's important for your daily routine? Like, you know, like, oh, I get up and I make sure I read some poetry or I, you know. Every morning I wake up. I have to shower. You gotta do it? I have to shower. You don't have to have not have do it? Shower. I can't. I, I never not shower. Interesting. As a big dude, I need to shower all the time. I get if you. If I don't shower, I feel gross. And then everyone around me, I feel like can is hyper aware of how gross I feel. Yeah, you don't want to smell like a birdcage, you know? Yeah. I, I As long as my clothes are clean and I like seem clean, I don't have that much emphasis of a need to shower, but I do need to look clean. But every morning, a thing that I do is I wake up really early because I have to write copy every morning for Chrono. Uh, I, I have like a big list of ones that I start and then I like kind of like finish them that morning just in case I want to throw in like a current joke or something like that. Yeah. And uh, basically like once I'm done with that, I am like up for a little bit and I like to like ha like take the time to have a cup of coffee and just like chill out a little bit quietly for a minute to, before I face my day. Understood. All it's right. important. All right. Let's try this. Um, all right, cool. This is from. Wait, let's try this. What do I do? So I'm gonna. Oh. Oh, oh you my. my lens. Oh my. So you're gonna go? Are you going back? Kindle Road, Mount Ember. I can't fly there, huh? No. So what's the plan? So I'm gonna go back to the mainland then, and then okay, I'm gonna, we're gonna go try to Fuchsia. Okay, yeah, yeah. Why can't I just fly to Fuchsia from here? Though? I know. Let's I be real. Bub kiss. Um. Okay. This is. Pretty good. It's actually topical. From Augustin Heredia. On a top five places you would like to visit on vacation, if you had time, of course, what would be your fourth choice? Love from Argentina. Can't wait for a bus to rhyme. He's what would, here. Boom. What, what would be the fourth choice? Yeah. Which way is four? I would Second say like, least? Yeah. What a weird question. Probably like Korea. Really least tight. Favorite, see, favorite least least. So favorite? like, if you had five choices of places you want to go, if you had money and time, what's your fourth choice? Like, you know, number one would be Tokyo. Number not two, not your bottom, but your one above the bottom. Yeah, and it's not somewhere you wouldn't want to go. It's just not among like your ultimate need to go. Probably Italy. It'll be tight. Yeah, I want to go to Italy really bad, but I don't know the, if it's the number one. Number one place for me is Japan. Yeah. yeah. The, exactly. thing that, I, the thing is that the thing is I want to go to Japan with someone who speaks and understands oh. everything and is a part of the culture. Yeah. So it's not Otherwise. like I'm stuck with a tour guide or running around. I, the the number my number one thing I hate about travel is feeling like I'm being taken advantage of. Oh, by, like, by by people who know I'm an American. Right? They're like, "Hey, American, gonna spend his money." I was uh, when I was in Lebanon uh, in 2010. Go north. Uh, I was with my. We were at a. My dad like basically is like a well known person in in his village, his hometown. And uh, me and my stepbrother were like getting a soda from the liquor store, and the guy charged me like three thousand lira, and it's like not that expensive for soda. How much money it's, is that? It's, it's like it's like two seventy five, I think, something uh -huh. like that. A little overpriced, and uh, my my, uh, oh my stepbrother got heated, and was like yelling at him in Arabic, and the guy like got mad and just took the took the money I gave him. Yeah. And I was like, what's wrong? He's like, he tried to fuck you out of your, your lira. He charged more for you. And I was like, why? Is it because you're an American. Well, fuck you, like, that you, like, noise. Didn't talk. And so you, he just assumed you'd pay him whatever he asked. That's bullshit. That pissed me off. I'm like, yeah. come on, man. Fuck you. Like, don't be like that. Yeah, that's... I'm sure I got my... my I'm sure someone from Lebanon or that currency system is going to be like, it's actually wrong, but I... You know, a couple... It was eight years ago. I don't, yeah, really I don't remember. Yeah, I don't remember. It's probably even a different conversion right now. I yeah. would love to not fight a poison type. Yeah, me too, dude. This has been me. I you got earthquake, especially with vile plume. I've I know, just been I know, but it's just like I have ten earthquakes. And that's it. <laughs> so many Pokemon. Questions. Who else wants to fight? You guys? Is this better? We'll see. We'll see. There's like some bird boys you can fight too. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Are there trainers on the way to uh, Victory Road? No. On huh? the way to mm -hmm. the radio. Not like not like in Jodo where you had like that path. Yeah. Yeah. On the road to Mama the way. Radio. Yeah. I gotta get there. We gotta go, Mama <laughs> Way. Going there, going there. This that is a song foul. about that place that we are going. That is there. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> this question from Dude. Dude. 
Favorite games of 2018 so far? Anything upcoming you're excited for? God of War is the best fucking game of the year so far. I need it. I am obsessed with it. I love it. It's incredible. Uh, my video at this point may or may not be out. I don't know. If this episode if this episode airs before May 4th or around May 4th, then you've already seen my thoughts, but I don't know. I have no games that I've really played this year except for Monster Hunter. So Monster Hunter. Like, I guess I feel like I didn't even really get to finish it. I'm just like too busy to like put any meaningful amount of time into a game. Like mostly I've just been like kind of fucking around with games. Like, yeah. And, like I played a bunch of Xenoblade Chronicles 2, which was a good game, but that was from last year, but like I didn't finish it. I'm playing Final Fantasy 9 now. Just, you know, just a lot of stuff going on that's just like basic as hell. I would love to like play. I want to play God of War really bad. It's so good. I really want to play it. I do too. I've been like waiting. I haven't, I haven't watched any of the stuff that I know that's been you guys have been doing. I'm like, I want to watch it. I but I haven't it. even I played I haven't even played fucking Uncharted 4 yet. Neither have I. I had it for I've had it since it came out and I just never Yeah, Uncharted 4 I have not touched. I've been wanting to for quite some time. I'm completely but... unspoiled on it, but I just want to play it. Yeah, me too. Is Uncharted the one with Nathan Drake? Yeah. Yeah. And this one's the lady one. No, no, four. that's the DLC. That's oh. the, it's an add-on game. It's like which, an which extra. They basically made like a brand new game. Yeah, it's like her. a full game, isn't it? They yeah. just like use the engine to make another game, which is like I think fine. Yeah, it's tight, and I love those characters. But I have to play. I have to play Uncharted Four first before I move on to the other. What was I it? Love Lost Uncharted Legacy? Three. Everyone hated Uncharted Three. I loved it. I, I thought, thought it was great. sick. I thought it was a sick game. <laughs> uh, but yeah, hopefully that answers your question. Man, we're we're just making the slowest of progress. This is just how it's you gonna know, be. It's, 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 it's how it happens, guys. You're killing it. Let's uh, let's give it a little. Uh, Let me just kill this muck real yeah. real quick. Let me Rapid see how much boys. how much money you're gonna get fucked on from a muck. Let me you know see how much muck backwards XP. is right. Yeah, I do. Okay, so I it's know. actually the base. You know, Venonat was supposed to be switched yeah. with <laughs> with Grimer. Yeah, with and it evolves into muck. If you flip the letters around, you will see. Well, it's cum, like cumin, so it's like a spice Pokemon. Yeah, it's a delicious All right, next Pokemon. time on Beer Bros, more fucking of the same shit that you've been unfortunately watching. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. Kind of gross, kind of sad, but kind of cool. We're having a good time. See you guys next Peace. time. Peace. Yo, welcome back. Lie to your parents. It's a big guy. You fucking fish. There has to be something for people to enjoy while we're doing this bullshit. What is it? Will Sean Bean die? I'm Gerard. And I'm, I'm Alex. I'm through his chest like Tom Skull Island. Triple lips. I want some pizza. I don't give a shit. See you guys later.